YouTube friends and family. Welcome to Tuesday. It's Tuesday. It's Tuesday. I'm pretty sure about that. It's definitely Tuesday. Uh, I'm playing. I'm playing hooky today. Actually, the forecast temperature today is supposed to be at near or above 80 degrees Fahrenheit which is an impressively warm temperature considering last week it was snowing. Uh, so there's that. There's a, I gotta do some billing and some paying of bills. And I also need to sort of wrap my brain around what happened yesterday at the College of the Atlantic and how to respond to what happened, which I'll show, should be able to share with you soon. Anyway, thanks for coming with me on my day today, and it's gonna be a beautiful day. We're gonna have a great, great day, aren't we? I was just preparing my street tires, um, my summer tires, I should say, because they handle so much better. They're a lower profile wheel and, and wider tire. And so I was just picking the rocks at them and then I was like, oh, what's that little chunk of metal? And I grabbed my metal cutters and pulled it out. And pfft, bummer, man. Just a quick, quick trip over to my father's house. He uh, just told me yesterday he has my check ready for those two days that I worked with him last week. This will be like the fastest he's ever paid me for anything. This is awesome. Since I'm doing banking today, I kind of want that money right there.
Can you hear that? There's a number of generators running in the neighborhood. There's been a power outage. My mother actually called me and she's affected as well. Uh, I looked online and there's 1,700 power, power uh, electricity customers without power right now in our area. I also lost internet too, which is sort of strange. Didn't lose phone, lost internet. It, come, it comes over the same wire. I don't know how that works, but my mother always calls to keep me informed of when everyone else loses power. It, this is like one of those times when I get to be smug, like, oh, you lost power? Jeez, we have the sun is shining. We have lots of, lots of electricity today. <laughs> Hi, hi. I really need to buckle down here and pay some bills and get an invoice out for my day at the college yesterday. Uh, well, actually, the first thing on my list was to do the do not call because I get so, like every day I get three out-of-state calls that are business solicitations, unsolicited solicitations for stuff that I have no desire for. I just want to talk a little bit about my um, potential, you know, opportunity and, you know, not about what the opportunity might be, but it, it starts, you know, you thinking about life and the opportunities that do present itself and, you know, do I want to, you know, bang nails and be a carpenter for the foreseeable future? Do I want to start looking for more of a career path? Do I want to go back to school? Do I want to reinvent myself? There's lots of questions, you know? Um, and so I'm exploring any opportunity I get right now. And, and it makes you start to, you have to confront certain um, subject areas that you haven't really thought that much about. Like, how do you feel about moving? Okay. How do you feel about staying where you are and living away from your family for your job for a portion of the week and then coming back? Uh, how do you feel about your you know, kids changing schools? You know, all that stuff is just questions that you ask yourself. I mean, there's all the other typical stuff, like what will my roles and responsibilities be? Um, you know, what are the expectations? You know, how will I be evaluated? Um, what are our goals? What is the definition of success? Uh, and then, you know, what am I going to get paid? Um, so, you know, there's all that stuff. But, you know, it's really these bigger life questions, you know, of place and community and um, where the, you know, I got kids, you know, I got to think about that. Anyway, I'm going to reduce this pile. You'll see this. It was just going to go, it's going to be disappeared into some organization here. Okay. All right. You ready? It'll happen like in 10 seconds, maybe 15. And most of it will disappear because I'm going to magically take it from this pile and put it into a new pile over here. thing Emmett says to me when I get off the bus really you had to be shirtless I think maybe his friends were making fun of him because his dad was shirtless yeah so what if there was just a big snowstorm a week ago it's beautiful out I am headed off for a meeting at my neighbor's house two doors down they are getting ready they have purchased a property that we've been to before that they're looking to put an addition on and do some significant remodels to sell their house and move. Uh, it's still in our town, it's just in a different location. So, uh, they're two door, I'm just gonna bike down, I'm not gonna drive down there. I, it's a beautiful day. And I'd love to feel that wind through all my hair. <laughs>
not even far enough to work up sweat. And I just realized I forgot my helmet. a bit early. I could ride home and ride back a couple times probably, but I'll just hang. That meeting went very well. I have now secured a job to do a major remodel and 20 foot by 28 foot addition for my neighbors. I'm so excited to be working for them too because uh, it's, I, I really enjoy working for friends. I know that some contractors say that they never die, they never work for friends, blah, blah, blah. I think it's so much fun. It's just great. Anyway, heading back home and uh, bringing an end to my official work day. See what's happening with the family. Thanks for coming with me, folks. Thanks for being a part of my vlog. And see you around. Ooh, stop getting mail here. <laughs>